Hello, welcome to my demo. So today here we have Pepper. Pepper is a humanoid robot which is made by SoftBank Robotics. And the goal Hi. of her is to use her tablet to um, basically give a feedback survey. The feedback survey would be used in primary schools. The idea is that because she has such a friendly exterior, uh, she'll probably be able to get really useful um, information from the younger students because she feels more like you're talking to a friend rather than like a serious adult. So we can use this feedback to improve the schools. So to get her app on the tablet started, we use Choreograph and I'll show you that a little bit later. But so the tablet app was created with the web, web suite. So just a bit of JavaScript, a bit of HTML and CSS, and also some Python as well to kind of connect to the, to, well, to Pepper's services. We have her autonomous life switched on. Also, so that means she can move around like quite human-like when she speaks and other things. She's listening out to what I currently say. So we have like the speech recognition and that will be used to start up the app in the beginning. And we'll have um, services throughout the app such as, um, well, she'll be speaking to you. So she'll like read out the questions and say other little like funny little bits as well to keep, keep the user interested while doing the survey and even her LEDs will light up at the beginning. So this is everything that I've put into the program to kind of make the feedback survey more fun and uh, just interesting to do. Because usually feedback surveys online are quite dull, aren't they? So it's great to have Pepper as like a new medium to kind of make this more exciting, especially for kids who, you know, lose, lose uh, attention quite quickly. So I'll get started in just a second. Sophie's feedback gap started. Would you like to start the quiz? Okay, so you can see that her eyes are kind of going around, so she's listening out for a key phrase so I can start the app. And that key phrase is begin, begin. Okay, so now the app is loading up, or the feedback survey. The first thing that we need to type in is how many students are doing the survey today. So it won't accept any um, bad input, so like um, characters or empty or um, decimal. It won't accept an integer in a certain range. Question one. How happy have you felt at school so far this year? One being not much. Ten meaning that it's the best year so far. Welcome to the survey. So we can see that this is a slider-based question, and she's reading, reading out all the questions. And So I'm going to put that um, school's been pretty good this year, and enter that in. Question two. Which subject do you like the most? This one is a kind of multiple choice based question. So, um, well, if I didn't put anything Please in. Please select an answer before moving on to the next question. She'll complain that I haven't um, entered anything. So I'm gonna go ahead and select, um, maybe I like English the most this time around. Question key. three, what is the main reason for liking this subject? So I'm gonna say, maybe I like it because it's relaxing to write stories maybe relaxing to write maybe the student likes question four what's the best part of the day at school so um also we can notice here we have like a little progress bar on the bottom so this is good to keep the engagement up if you know how far along you are how much you have left to do so what's the p best part of the day at school maybe we say um uh break time let's say the student's a bit bit cheeky so they say break time's the best part of the day which is fair enough I quite like that part who doesn't question five how much do you enjoy the school lunch one being not much ten meaning that you love the school lunch I thought the school lunch was always pretty good so maybe I'll put a ten you can always see that the slider always resets to five and that the input the text text input questions always reset to empty so that's quite convenient question for the student six. which subject do you find less fun so all these questions are, have the goal of trying to find like key information that we can use to improve the school. So what makes the school good? What makes the maybe certain lessons uh, a bit less engaging? So let's say um, maybe art's a bit Question less fun. Seven. Why do you find it a bit less fun? So maybe it's because not enough pencils. So that could be a good reason. Maybe they don't have enough equipment to actually do the lesson properly. So just useful bits of information Question like this. Eight. How hard is the homework? One being easy, ten being super difficult. 
so yeah, because she has such a friendly appearance, it'll be it'll be much more fun for let's say to it just feels like a conversation, a natural conversation really Question to nine. get this out Did rather than a survey. So I'll put I'll put yes. I had a good time interacting with you, Peppa. Question ten. Any idea to make school better? And then, uh, well, this is a text input based question. Please venture an answer before moving on to the next question. So she has a bit of validation here also, just to, um, well, make sure they don't put an empty answer in here as well. So any, any idea to make the school better? Um, uh, maybe, um, well, more, more pencils, let's just put. I can't think of a good reason personally now. And then, so that's the first user's Thanks finished. For the survey. Next user, please. So we put Question two users one. at the beginning. How happy have you felt at school so far this year? Mm. One being not much, ten meaning that it's the best year so far. So we'll go through all the, all the questions again as a second user. I'll do a little bit more quickly this time because you've already seen what kind of questions there are to offer. Question two, which subject do you like the most? Another little uh, thing as well here is we have this kind of cute little icon of Pepper. Maybe if they're getting bored, they might t Hi. decide to touch it. You can see if you touch it, the speech Howdy. bubble changes. And, um, well, she, she says it out loud. It's quite fun. Hi. Just to keep you kind of, uh, well, keep a, keep a kid interested in a survey like this. So let's just speed, speed run through question the questions. Three. What is the main reason for liking this subject? Question four, what's the best part of the day at school? So yeah, it's quite an easy little interface. They just um, touch five. and type. How much do you or they'll just, or some of them One you just, not much. Ten meaning that you love the school some lunch. of them you just slide and then the multiple choice Question you just six. select, select Which one. So it's pretty intuitive for anyone to use really. Just select your answer and Question go. Seven. Why do you find it a bit less fun? I'll just put no, no reason. Maybe they just find it a bit less fun. Question eight. How hard is the homework? One being easy, 10 being super difficult. Question nine. Did you enjoy interacting with me today? It was interesting. Question 10. Any idea to make school better? Uh, not really, just a bit no. Okay, so now we put in an email that we want to send the results to. So I'm just going to type in NTU at test.com or .co.uk actually. Thanks for taking the survey trying to send results. Results have been sent to email. Alright, so now we take a look at our email server and I'm using MailTrap. So we can see a few seconds ago an email just came in to NTU at test.co.uk, which was what we just typed in. And then we can see that um, here's like a little email from Pepper with the student result breakdown. And it's nicely formatted, so you've got user 1 results, questions 1 to 10, you've got the question, and then uh, you know, they're the, whatever they've answered. So you could do up to about 100, 100 students, really. But um, and you could also change change the questions and things like that if you wanted a different kind of survey. So yep, that is that is my demo demonstration. Hope you enjoyed.